How do we know that treatment A is better than treatment B? To answer that question, we're going to look to a randomized trial. And there are thousands being done right now all over the world. They are central to systematic reviews and they are central to clinical guidelines that affect the care of millions of people. They are right at the heart of our evidence-informed healthcare systems. That then makes it really strange that those of us who actually do trials, we design them, we run them, we report them, the evidence base that we have to support our decisions is astonishingly thin. So if we think about a trial, we need to recruit participants. How do we design an effective strategy to get people into our trial? It's tricky to find that evidence. Once we've got them in the trial, how do we keep them there? What outcomes should we measure? How do we measure the outcomes? How much data should we collect? Do we send our trial teams out to clinical sites? Or can we do checking of what they are doing remotely? All of these questions have a remarkably thin evidence base. Trial teams are forced to use experience and judgment. This is the challenge that Trial Forge aims to address. What we want to do is look at the whole trial pathway from the research question right through to reporting and dissemination of the results and all the processes in between. We want to look for evidence where that evidence exists. What do we know about how to keep people in a trial, for example? Sometimes we will find evidence, but very often we will not. And in those situations, what we want to do is to work collaboratively to build up a methodological research agenda of important questions that will provide additional evidence for us, people who design trials, to use in our research designs, our conduct, our dissemination, our analysis. We want to provide an evidence base so that we ourselves can improve our decision making. It's about coordination and it's about collaboration. There are thousands of trials happening right now, which means there are hundreds, perhaps thousands of people, all dealing with the same challenges, the same problems within their trials. They have limited evidence to base their decisions upon right now, and that's what we want to try and change with Trial Forge. We want to increase the evidence base to support those decisions, to squeeze out efficiencies where we can, and try and start solving some of the problems that we are all dealing with.